Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, the Himalayan here is going in to have its ECU firmware updated to the same as the Scrams. Apparently, the earlier versions of these can throw check engine light, so stay tuned and uh, let's see if it's made any difference to how the bike rides. Yeah, I saw in a video, just as the Scram was being released, that the Scram had a different engine map to the Himalayans. And that the rumour was then that the engine map, Scram engine map, was being put on the Himalayans as well. Uh, mine's a 2021 model, I was bought in 2021, just before Christmas. Uh, it's a Euro 5 and the old Euro 5 would, and this is this one's done it, occasionally throw up a meaningless check engine light. I'm not exactly sure what caused it. I'll see if I can get to find out what the check engine light was. Um, but um, I've been kind of keen to get the Scram ECU map put onto this. So yeah, so hopefully uh, it makes a bit of a difference. Now there is a chance that I'll also get an Iridium spark plug in this and um, I'm currently running this on um, 98 um, which I just wanted to check the mileage on it see if I actually get any extra miles out of it versus 91 or um, E10 so it will be interesting to see but I, and I'll fill you up on that later, so stay tuned for future videos on that front. The risk being with the 98 is that on a hot day it can overheat the engine. But the manual does say 91 or better. And some dealers are recommending to run these on 98, so yeah, which I don't get. E10 or 10% ethanol, I got 304 k's out of a tank. And that was with about just under 5 litres left in the tank. When I pick the bike up I'll film it again and uh, we will see if there's any difference to how it rides oh and another thing too that's um having been replaced under warranty is the latch for the seats um it broke i'll try and take a photo of how i fixed it temporarily in case the same thing happens to you guys and here we are pulling up at uh, twisted moto and it'd be interesting to see the difference in the bike with the new engine map and I'll keep you posted, so stay tuned. <laughs> 